Hey, what's going on everyone and uh, welcome to another video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to reset your Windows 10 password using Hire and Boot CD. So um, maybe it happened to you that you try to log in into the computer and you try one password and you get uh, the password is incorrect. So you try again uh, a different password and you uh, realize that you completely forgot your password. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to reset your password. Um, the only caveat uh, of this method is that you uh, you need a, a, another computer. You need another computer in which you can prepare the recover the recovery boot CD or the recovery flash drive. So let's get started. The first thing that we need to do we need to open the browser uh, and then go to hidenbootcd.org forward slash download. In the download in the download section, scroll all the way down and click here where it says file name and download the ISO image. Once you download the ISO image, uh, then we need a, a utility that is going to install the ISO image into a USB flash drive. So go ahead and uh, plug in your USB drive into the computer. Uh, for this, I'm using Rufus. I'm going to make sure I select the right, uh, the correct drive. Uh, then I'm going to browse for my ISO image. I'm going to select Hyrus Boot CD ISO. Click Open. For the partition scheme, I'm going to leave it as GPT. Um, target system UEFI. I'm going to leave the name the same and click Start. Click OK. And let it finish. Okay, once the installation into the flash drive is complete, go ahead and plug the flash drive into the computer in which you forgot the password and reboot the computer. All right, so once the computer boots into Hiram's Boot CD, go ahead and click on the Start menu. And on the search box, type password. Click on Empty Password Edit. Click on open to open the sound file. This will open or list all the accounts inside the operating system. Next, click on the account for which you want to reset the password and click on change password. Enter your new password. And this time, don't forget it. And click OK and save changes. Click exit and finally, restart the computer. All right, so once the computer restarts, let's go ahead and try to log in again, this time with a new password. And press Enter. And now we should be able to log in. All right, so that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. As always, remember to subscribe, give it a like, and leave a comment, and see you in the next video.